In what could be one of the biggest finds to come out of the Gaza Strip, a sarcophagus has been discovered that likely belongs to a prominent figure. The sarcophagus has been uncovered in a 2,000-year-old Roman cemetery. The cemetery was discovered last year in the northern Gaza Strip and so far, 90 individual and mass graves have been found at the site. The site is being supervised by a French team of experts. The site itself was uncovered last year by construction workers on an Egyptian-funded housing project. The Antiquities Ministry said that it is believed that the sarcophagus is made from lead and likely belonged to a high-profile figure from the era, but added it had not yet been opened. The team will await the arrival of an international metal expert before they go ahead with opening the sarcophagus. Ministry spokesman Tarek Al-Af told Reuters that some clay jars and other belongings found in the cemetery pointed to the Roman era, around 2,000 years ago. The sarcophagus has been put in a protective wooden container and would be subject to further study by Palestinian and international expert teams. AF told reporters that the cemetery in northern Gaza was located at the site of the old seaport from the Greek and Roman era. Ruins discovered there include the remains of a siege by Alexander the Great as well as a Mongol invasion. It is worth mentioning that Gaza is rich in antiquities having been an important trading spot for many civilizations, from as far back as the ancient Egyptians and the Philistines depicted in the Bible, through the Roman Empire and the Crusades. The region lies on the confluence of several ancient civilizations with Egypt on its southwest border and has been a center of conflict between Israel and Palestine. So that was all for today's video. Let us know what you think about it in the comments section and subscribe to our channel so you don't miss out on our latest uploads. With that said, we will see you next time. Until then, take care.